Can artificial intelligence keep your cat from bringing home prey? Mice, birds, rats. These are actually all real customer examples of cats trying to bring in different types of prey. I can barely look at this video. If you don't have a cat, or maybe your cat doesn't go outside, you may not know just how terrible this problem is. I'm Lindsay Mastis. I am an independent journalist, and I'm also a cat mom. And this problem horrifies me. I met up with Thomas Rosinski at CES, the Consumer Electronics Show. He has found a solution to this gory problem. It all started with Jinx. My brother ha ended up adopting a cat through quite strange circumstances. He says Jinx chose to live with his brother after his original family adopted a dog. So Jinx chose his forever family. That's exactly how what happened. And your brother had no choice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But this is not a fairy tale ending. The cat, after a while, started bringing in gifts, and it started off <laughs> infrequently, and then it became more and more of an issue, uh, to the point where it was almost daily. So. What kind of gifts? Mice, birds, rats, um, yeah. Some cats hunt at night. That means they'll sometimes bring in prey at night to play with and even kill. Googling how to remove blood stains from carpets isn't the nicest thing. <laughs> not, not what you want to be doing at three in the morning. This is their solution. It's called Only Cat. It's a door that syncs up with your cat's microchip. So you can choose which cats come in, go out, um, and at what times. But then it's also got a, a camera inside the device. That's where artificial intelligence comes in. So as the cat approaches, it's scanning in real time and d determining whether the cat's trying to bring in something that it shouldn't, so unwanted gifts. And if it does, then it temporarily locks. It'll lock your cat out if it detects prey of any kind. So you can see here, contraband detected, the well, time uh, the, the, the cat was trying to come in. We've got some yeah, pretty incredible examples, rats and birds and lizards, snakes. Uh, Oh. oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, so, <laughs> I wasn't so, expecting a snake right then. That's actually a, a slow worm, uh, which is a, a legless lizard. <laughs> that was a legless lizard. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. I Just seeing the video, it's a little hard for me to watch, to be honest, and I cannot imagine a cat, like my cat bringing this into the house. I would have such a hard time with this. I think you can tell like where my phobia is. The snake, for sure, is one of them that I... I and I know you said it's not a snake, but it looks like a snake to me. It does. He says the technology is effective. Eventually, cats stop trying to bring in prey for at least a while. Does the cat kind of get it, the, the picture? They'll typically try a few times, and then after, they'll quite quickly figure out the rules that oh, they're not allowed in. So in, in our case, for example, Jinx would be trying to, to, to bring in Bray, but after a few weeks, just very rarely tries. But very occasionally, we'll just see all the defenses still up. Mm, okay, so even though they get the picture, they think, well, let me just try again here and there to see if circumstances have changed. Yeah, in case the cat, flat, uh, the cat door is fixed. And <laughs> oh, they think it's broken. I can totally see that some cats might just assume it's broken because why on earth wouldn't we want your little gifts? For some, a cat's prey is a real hazard. There was just so many customers who were just desperate for, for, for this. Um, we've got customers who are under, undergoing chemotherapy um, and so immunocompromised and essentially said, well, we need a solution, otherwise we're going to have to get rid of our cats. It works by getting plugged in. If the power goes out and the cat's outside, are they stuck? No, so we've actually got an internal battery which weathers short-term power interruptions, but also in the app you can decide on whether the, the device would lock or unlock before um, the power runs out. How do you train AI to do this? Yeah, so it's um, essentially image-based classification, uh, so using convolu convolutional neural networks um, and showing examples of what uh, of what a cat looks like with prey and cat with, uh, just transiting through. And AI is just extremely skillful at being able to establish what, what's 
even even sometimes as a cat's approaching before there's a clear view of the mouth almost simply a, an expression in the cat's eyes or um, <laughs> it can be enough that the the system just detects uh, in faster than a blink of an eye whether the cat's trying to bring something in i noticed that on a lot of these videos the cat's eyes are very dilated which is what happens to my cat when he's just playing with string toy around the house so i have to imagine that the AI is picking up on even just the eyes. Yeah, yeah, just the, even some some subtleties that the human mind can't perceive. He says it's learning all the time, including from cases where prey gets through. One example is uh, just a, a very small lizard that happened to be in a in a vertical direction, which obviously the the, the camera hadn't seen because typically when uh, there's prey in a the mouth and it tends to be in a horizontal direction. But yeah, just having a, just even a couple examples of that type just means that entry won't be allowed in those circumstances anymore. Thomas says so far only cat has a success rate of 99.6 percent, and he expects that to improve. If you're curious about how AI is changing the world for the better, be sure to subscribe.